hi good day guys uh, today I just want to show you a short video on setting the choke because I have not covered that in any of my carb videos so I'm gonna just speak to you about setting the choke okay just to show you what and how the choke actually operates this is with the cable off I'm going to pull the lever to show you what actually happens when you pull the lever inside the cabin when you pull this is what happens inside it closes up when you push it in again then it opens now when the choke is not in use it should be in this position when the choke is in use like with your morning start it normally moves to that position and then you will close it slowly and slowly and slowly as the car warms up and then with normal driving it will come back to that position so now you can understand why it's important to set this choke correctly because if you don't set it correctly say for example you set it now but the choke is actually in that position but inside the cabin it's pushed right in that's why it's very important to set the cable correctly and I'm going to show you how to do that now okay firstly inside the cabin push the choke lever right down and then the next thing that you're going to do is you're going to grab hold of your cable and your cable is going to go inside of these two nuts here this one here and that one there that's how the cable is actually held fast so the first thing that you do is you take your cable and put it in this groove here but you don't tighten it yet okay next you pull this portion here this is the arm that controls the flap in the in the carburetor pull it towards you so that you can see that hole there can you see the hole there and that hole is as you know where we will insert the cable through okay now you can see you got your cable through the first screw and it's also through this arm here which I said controls the flap in the carburetor so what you do at this stage is you ensure that you pull this lever all the way up up this way so that it is in the open position so remember inside the car the choke is pushed in all the way okay now you can tighten up the first screw just tighten up in such a way that it uh, holds the cable in place this and the second nut as I said this is the one that controls the movement of the flap in the carb so like I said there make sure you don't tighten it at that stage because it's going to be partially open make sure that you pull the lever all the way up till it can't go anymore having a look at the carb you'll see it's open And there you can see it's tightened and going back into the cabin you will see that the choke is in the in position so there you go that's it that's how you set your choke and always whenever you have your carb off make sure that that flap inside is in the position um, so that you need to make necessary adjustments from time to time because these things these bolts they can come loose eh? so always just take care because you may be as I said driving with your choke partially on and that can cause performance issues and will make the car heavier on fuel hope that tip will help you guys so thanks a lot again for watching